let's sign. Let's do this. Turn right onto Spice Springs Lane. Still then turn my... right onto Power Line Road. Still need my GPS. <laughs> I will. I do not know how to get anywhere right now. I'm Gustavo, I'm uh, Christy's husband. Uh, allegedly. Allegedly. Uh, I just wanted to say to the camera that uh, she's mean to me, please help me, please help me. <laughs> Somebody come get him. Hey y'all, good morning. My name is Christy, I'm on a weight loss journey to lose a hundred pounds. Um, right now I'm driving down this back road uh, to get to where I need to go to get on the highway so that I can go get my lashes done. Uh, but my first time getting my lashes done here in Texas with a new person, I'm actually really nervous about that because um, I uh, love my eyelash lady back home and I'm so sad that I don't have her anymore. Um, but yeah, so I'm gonna go get my lashes done. I'm gonna take you guys with me today and show you guys all what I'm eating. Um, so I haven't eaten breakfast or anything like that just yet. Um, I probably need to wait a couple hours anyway just because I did put a whitening strip in. Um, so I'm probably just gonna wait until after obviously I get my lashes done. Um, I'm gonna come home, I'm gonna prep up some stuff, and um, I'm gonna make some chicken tonight. Um, but I think my husband was gonna go to the store and get some, um, I don't know, it's called Michoacano or something like that, I don't know, but it has some, some meat. We're At gonna the get next some stop meat sign, from the market. turn right. I think anyway is what he's trying to do, but if not, hey, it is what it is. But I just want to take you guys along with me, see what I'm eating today, how I'm going to try to be my low calorie deficit, what my points look like, what my calories look like. I'm going to show all of that to you guys today um, and see if we're able to do anything fun outside of the house. So let's go get on this highway. I got the GPS on the and side, we're going to get these lashes turn right onto done FM today. It's a little gloomy here in Texas and they got some stuff coming in from like San Antonio area and so it's gonna be coming this way oh man like I said I am so used to uh, you know thunderstorms and crazy weather but Texas just scares the crap out of me <laughs> they actually said to start preparing for hurricane season um, end of May like I guess that's hurricane season when it starts I always thought it was September but I guess maybe that's just Florida I don't really know maybe I'm wrong altogether but um, it's scary um, and I talked to my, my husband about it the other day and I was like hey so like are we gonna start taking some preparations you know and we're like well we're just gonna get some water you know get some backpacks ready so if something happens and we need to evacuate we're just gonna hop in the car and hop on the highway and go so that's our plan <laughs> apparently we're not gonna stick anything out um but yeah so um she got my eyelashes done it kind of stings right here i don't know if you guys can see it or not but she kind of like stung me or i guess a lash got stuck to my skin and she went to get it out and it kind of stings um, but yeah, so I'm gonna get this order. I'm gonna show you guys what I'm making, um, for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. I haven't even had breakfast yet. Um, so yeah, so I, like I said, I was rushing this morning. Let me tell you guys what I'm doing. So right now I am, the girls got their big girl bed, right? They absolutely love their big girl bed. It is so cute. Um, but yeah, so uh, now that they have that, what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to get them to go from my bed to their bed so that I can have my room again. 
like an adult. No. But, um, but yeah, so I'm trying to put them in their bed and get them used to it. And so a lot of times I'm just falling or having them fall asleep with me in their room. And then I go to my room and then they wake up because they have to go potty and they cry and they say, mommy, my bed. And so then I have to go back in there with them to their bed. And so it's just been a little process this, these last few days. Um, but I think we're making some good progress. So I'm excited about it and I can't wait to make that full transition of just staying asleep, staying in their bed and then understanding like, hey, this is my room, this is my bed and I'm a big girl. So, so heart, heart wrenching. So now I got big girls now and we're trying to figure out the whole daycare and preschool, pre-K situation down here. So um, they had a babysitter that took care of them since they were three months old. We absolutely love her and we miss her so much and their whole family. And um, that was probably one of the biggest devastating, devastating um, things about leaving Oklahoma was the fact that we were not going to be with her anymore because she loved our kids so much. The whole family did. And so I love you guys. Love you. Uh, we miss you. Um, but um, that's probably the hardest thing. I'm about to tear up thinking about it. But they're going to find a daycare, a little curriculum for them for learning and things like that. And so we're just trying to find the best one for the best budget. Um, but it kind of looks like we're going to end up spending an arm and a leg. Just saying. Texas. Go big or go home, apparently. On the daycare. Um, but yeah, so uh, let me get this grocery order. And then I will chit chat with y'all probably whenever I get back to the house. Okay, you guys. So I'm just getting home. And it started to come down just a little bit. It got a little heavy sometimes on the rain. But, um. It's going to get pretty crazy here very soon. Let me go ahead and show you guys what all I got. Um, it was a little bit more than a grocery bag, but not necessarily like a grocery haul type thing. Not in my opinion anyway, because this is just for like a meal or some lunches. So I'm going to show it to you guys, okay? So let's switch over here. There we go. All right. So what I plan on doing with this, um, as you can tell, this is all like... Spanish rice, um, I got some chips right here, some queso, salsa, I grabbed some fire roasted um, corn and some reduced fat Fiesta blend cheese. So now this stuff is um, 80 calories for a third of a cup with it being reduced. Um, I believe it's probably like two points for a serving. I'll have to put it up here for you guys so you can see. Um, but then this is zero points. This is two points for two tablespoons. I just got the great value because I saved two dollars today. <laughs> so I got that and um, obviously zero points for that as well. These are two points a piece if I'm not mistaken. But I do like, I, I like these and I like them around breakfast time to be honest. Uh, the uh, cinnamon coffee cake. That's that's my go-to. Mm -hmm. Hey, honey. Mm -hmm. You got your chip? High five. High five. No, thank you. Is it good? Yeah? Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. And then, so I got some Spanish rice and some chips. So, um, and then we got some green peppers and some limes. So, with this right here, what I plan on doing is, like, one night we're going to have, like, um... So one night what I plan on doing is having like some chicken taco bowls and then um, probably take some leftovers to work with some of the Spanish rice or the chips um, and just doing it like that. So I'll probably have that for a dinner and maybe a lunch or two. And then um, speaking of lunches, I went ahead and grabbed some of these. So this one right here I believe is only like one point if I'm not mistaken. I think this one's one point. Um, it might be two but... Um, but yeah, so it's the grilled chicken and broccoli avocado yeah, by Healthy Choice. It is 190 calories, so this is super calorie friendly. Um, 28 grams of protein for the bowl. And uh, it's just a nice option to have for lunch. So I have that. Don't be scared. It's thundering, and so Skyly's a little scared. Um, and then we also have the Healthy Choice Power Bowls, the Adobe Chicken. Now this one, let's take a look at the micros on this. 
This one is 330 calories, 26 grams of protein. So you get more protein in it. And honestly, guys, this is so good. I love the Power Bowl so much. Uh, there's just so much more flavor, uh, burst of flavor in your mouth on those. No. <laughs> and then I have the spicy black bean and chicken. I really like this one too. And this one is 200, 210 calories for 20 grams of protein. So this one right here seems mommy, like this is the one mommy, that's like mommy, hardcore protein. Mommy, Texas. Texas, yes, baby. <laughs> Let me see. Do it again. Say Texas. Texas. Yay. Yeah, mommy, put mommy, these ones down. No? no? Okay. You gonna show me? Yeah. Yeah? Texas. Texas. You doing it? You almost got it. Texas. There you go. Yeah. All right. Yay. You did so good. High five. Yeah. Alright, um, so I got all that stuff, um, so these are going to be like lunches, super easy lunches for me, um, or got a lazy night, pop one in the microwave, and get, get some chicken nuggets, no, I'm just kidding, um, and then I also got this, this is zero points as well, oh, points, so I believe this is one, and I think these are two points, if I'm not mistaken, I think each one of these are two points, um, but I also got some green pepper to go with, um, just to dice those up and put them aside for the week. Um, this right here is zero points, you guys, and a good whopping zero calories, so I like to get this stuff and keep it in the fridge. Uh -huh. It's okay, it's nothing, baby. Um, we got some baby spinach and arugula, some romaine lettuce to go with the taco bowls and just to have, and mommy, then some good old mommy. bananas. Okay, so you guys, this right here. So what I'm planning on doing with this, I have some apples and some oranges that I want to make sure we eat. So I'm going to try to make it in a very fun way for the kids. Um, and so I'm going to basically make some fruit salad. I'm going to take some apples, oranges, this, and like some almonds, and Mama. just mix it all together. Thank you, oh, thank you. All right, we got some toilet paper. All right, so uh, that's what I'm planning on doing with that. And I'm going to go ahead and make that today as well. So now I have the groceries put away. I'm gonna finally make me some breakfast today. Um, I'm gonna make some egg whites and some turkey sausage. Easy peasy, take me just a couple of minutes to make it. So I'm gonna do that. And then after I get done, I'm gonna pop up some veggies to have for the week. Um, so that's what we're about to do right now is eat some breakfast. Make some breakfast, eat some breakfast, prep up some veggies. <laughs> top bunk just watching cartoons it was the cutest thing ever hello mommy oh hello baby i'm gonna show baby mm -hmm. ah! mm. sana sana culada de rana seno sana hoy es sana mañana yay Ow, you want me to do it again? Okay. Sana sana de no sana sana culita de culito de rana. Seno sana hoy sana mañana. 
Yeah. Now it should feel better. If it doesn't feel better, then you're gonna have to go to daddy. Daddy's gonna have to put some really powerful medicine on it. Go take it to daddy and let daddy do it. He can do it better than mommy. Yeah? No? I never used them last week for the ones that I purchased in my Sam's Club haul. But I didn't use them because I didn't cut them. They weren't easy access, so I have to cut them. So I'm going to go ahead and do it since I have everything out right now. Just get it done. Um, I have planned to do it today anyway. But um, I want to show you guys. Look, at this is so weird. So whenever I open up the bell pepper pack, this was already chopped perfectly. Like it's a perfect slice. But it's just very questionable, so I'm going to discard it. I'm not going to eat it, um, but I'm going to chop up the rest of them along with the green ones that I got today and the onions. So I'm going to go ahead and chop those up. because I literally threw it away because I was like, I've never bought. <laughs> I shouldn't have told you. I didn't think about it till now. I figured you just figured out about it. Mm -mm. The veggies ended up turning out like so this is my white onion my purple onion and then I have the green yellow orange kind of mixed together and then the red onion so those are my peppers so no excuses this week we're gonna get these eaten up we're gonna put it into our mails we're gonna eat some good vegetables and um, you know give us some flavor and whatnot <laughs> Kids. Yeah, for kids. Mommy, a donut. Oh, yeah. Is, is it a donut? Let me see. Oh, yeah. You're going to eat the donut? Don't eat that paper. <laughs> yeah. Hi, uh, I'm Gustavo. I'm uh, Christy's husband. Uh, allegedly. Allegedly. 
I uh, just wanted to say to the camera that uh, she's mean to me. Please help me. Please help me. <laughs> Somebody come get him. Okay, you guys, so it is basically lunchtime. So for today, I decided just to have an easy peasy, a lemon squeezy. Y'all, that's my new phrase right now just because I just want everything to be simple. But uh, it's just a basic chicken salad. So I got my spinach, some tomato. Um, I'm going to use these chicken bites that I picked up from Sam's Club in it. So for this, it's um, 150 calories for four of them. And then I believe it's like one point per bite. So four of them, four points. It's good for me. So I'm going to toss it in the air fryer and that's what I'm having for lunch today. So whenever I put my spinach and arugula in here, I like to break it apart and just make it into like smaller pieces. Um, so that's what I like to do. I don't know why. camera dies so I'll put that on the charger and um but this is my salad so we got the nice little chicken pieces in it my cucumber tomato spinach arugula some cheese I have a little bit of ranch on the side that I'm gonna dip whenever I feel like it but it's only a tablespoon that I'm allowing myself to have just because I don't really need more plus I like salad with ranch but I also like it by itself especially whenever you have some meat in there to go with it it kind of takes care of itself with the flavor. Okay, you guys, so it's almost dinner time. So I'm gonna go ahead and start getting dinner ready. We're gonna have green beans, potatoes, and chicken. Um, I think we're looking at about four points-ish for dinner, considering what it is. We're very low in points today, very low in calories. So I'm gonna show you guys how I'm making it. I'm making it just a little bit different than I normally do, because normally I use like ranch and, um, brown gravy seasoning and I just sprinkle it over this time I'm just gonna use Italian because I saw someone else do it the other day and it looked really really good or maybe I just saw like a picture of it on Facebook I don't know but that's what I'm making today so as I was preheating the 360 I'm gonna cut up my potatoes and get my green beans put them in here I'm gonna do the chicken last just because I'm gonna use the same cutting board um, so I can't do the chicken first um, and I'm trying to have as little mess as possible uh, today and uh, normally I have like a clear baking dish that I would use for this um, or a casserole dish but uh, one's broke and the other one I don't know where it is so I'm just using a good old cake pan 
So that's what I'm about to do. I'm gonna cut up these potatoes and get this going. Yeah, so I had these soaking in cold water overnight. So these are nice, clean, and good to work with. Super easy peasy. Y'all know that's my life right now. Don't need any complications. No complications and no drama. Am I right? Can I get an amen from somebody in the back? No complications and no drama. Okay. If you're about that life and that's what you got going on, then please stay away from me. We do not need that in our lives anymore. Okay, so I actually had these soaking overnight. And um, yeah, so they soaked overnight in cold water. So they're good to go. And I'm really just trying to make everything as easy, convenient, because that's how I want my life right now. Yeah, that's plenty of potatoes for us. Okay, now I'm just gonna grab some regular old green beans in a can. I'm gonna cut them, or put them in here. So, yep. We just got done eating dinner. These kids are ready for bed, but I want to share with you real quick what my calories and my points look like for today. So on my points, uh, let's go. So today I use 19 points, or actually I use 17 points, and then I'm gonna use two more later on because I plan on eating one of those fudge bars, which is another two points. So that's a grand total of 19 for today. And then on my calories, I included that in there also, but it just kind of is what it is. Um, <laughs> hey, hey, what? It's coming up to 9.43, including the 90 calories that's gonna come from the fudge bar. So it's less than what I typically try to aim for as I'm losing weight, but I'm not gonna knock it. It was all pretty healthy. Oh, yes, it's night night time, let's go night night. All right, I gotta get these kids to bed. So, <laughs> good night everybody, and I'll see you guys in the next video. If you haven't subscribed, please make sure to do so by hitting that button below. I would love to have you here with me on my channel, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.